Hey everybody, it's time to get caught up on what you missed this week on Tyler Perry's If Loving You Is Wrong. Last week's episode ended with Kelly waiting up for Travis, but he never showed. She wakes up on the couch to rush her son Justice off to school when she runs into Marcy on a run with Randall. Marcy invites Kelly to Randall's birthday party and says Kelly can bring anyone but Esperanza. Kelly says Esperanza thought Marcy didn't like her, but Kelly is surprised by Marcy's real reason. It's not that I don't like her. I just I don't like the way she dresses around my husband. Esperanza is not who Marcy needs to watch out for. When Marcy gets home, Randall starts some kitchen loving. Little does she know that Alex is in her kitchen and Randall knows Alex can see them. Brad walks in, sees Randall and Marcy, and says he needs to have a talk to them. Or him and Alex could give them a show. Open up these blinds and go for it. You would never. Brad agrees and Alex doesn't seem too happy about that as he leaves for work. Kelly comes over to thank Alex for watching Justice and confesses that Travis hasn't come to see them yet. Alex tells her to just call him, which she does, and Travis plans to come over that night to ask her a question. Alex's visitors aren't over as Marcy comes to hide Randall's birthday present. Marcy sees the closed kitchen blinds and realizes Alex saw her and Randall. Marcy tries to bond with Alex about it, and Alex tells Marcy off. It's just a little inappropriate. Okay, I'm, I don't need to hear about all this. Marcy apologizes, but Alex says she needs to go lie down, so she should leave. Awkward. Over at Esperanza's house, Eddie tells Esperanza that he ran Julius's name and his records clean. Eddie thinks Esperanza warned him about Julius because she still loves him. Eddie tells her he only married his wife for the money and that he's so sorry. It's because I love you so much. You just make me crazy. Esperanza isn't swayed, stands her ground, and makes him leave. Meanwhile, Travis makes it to Kelly's new house and Kelly finally hears Travis say he wants to spend the rest of his life with her. Kelly, I want to ask you if you love me enough to be my friend. Wait, what? Kelly is shocked when Travis continues to tell her that he's marrying Callista, who he met on his mission. Travis asks what to tell Justice, but Kelly kicks him out. The night ends with Eddie walking up to his driveway when a car drives by and opens fire. Eddie's okay, but it looks like Esperanza's warning was right. And that's what you missed. Be sure to tune in next week for a brand new episode of Tyler Perry's If Loving You Is Wrong, Tuesday at 9, 8 central. And remember, if you miss it, we'll have another catch-up for you right here on Hashtag Own Show.